Hi, I'm Kyle with DIY Auto Homeschool, and if you're wondering what all these numbers and the size of your tires mean, well, today we're going to find out. Alright, well, here's the tire size on this tire off of this uh, Suburban, and for those of you who are familiar with these, you'll know that this is the wrong tire size. This is a 265-75-16, and this vehicle calls for a 265-70-16. Well, what's the difference? What do these mean? Let's break it down. The first number, the 265, this is the section width in millimeters, and the section width, the width of the tire from here to here. This is the section width, and that's measured in millimeters. The, sec the second number is the aspect ratio meaning the percentage of the section width that the sidewall height is so zoom out here a little bit the height here the aspect ratio says in this case since the section width is 265 265 millimeters of section width the aspect ratio says 75 percent of that is the height of this sidewall here and then the R means that it's a radial tire, and the 16 means it goes on a 16-inch wheel. And that is really the easiest breakdown for, for tires. It's, it's not that complicated once you understand what all these numbers mean. And you can actually take these numbers, if you, you know, 265 millimeters, 75% of that. You know, you've got two sidewalls here, so you could measure... You know, figure out what the height would be, add 16 inches, and you could come out real close to the exact height of this tire on this wheel. Now, the question other people have is, what size should my vehicle have on it? This sticker is on the driver's door on this vehicle, and it lists what the proper tire size for this vehicle is. Uh, front is 265 70 16 speed rating is s we'll get into that in another video and the rim is a 16 by 7 and the cold tire fl inflation pressure is 35 psi and the rear is the same tire size everything all the way over there some vehicles will have different tire sizes front rear some will have different pressures front rear so this sticker right here tells you what size tires you need and what pressure you need to put those tires at when they're on the vehicle Well, thank you for taking the time to watch this video, and go ahead, feel free to check out some of the other videos on the channel. Uh, to make it easy, I'll put them right, right, right here and right here, and uh, subscribe if you like these videos for some more content just like this, and I will see you in the next video.